Hello, everyone. Thank you for coming today. Um, another exciting day uh, in the annals of athletics at the University of Providence. Um, it's, uh, it's exciting that we get to announce our new head cross-country track and field coach today. We want somebody who can attract and retain quality people as University of Providence student athletes. We want someone who understands the value of academics and the mission at the University of Providence. We want someone who can enhance the community of Great Falls through the outreach that we provide as a department via athletics and who like all of the personnel in our department are great ambassadors for the university. We kind of take those considerations into account when we go through the list of candidates for jobs. And so to that end, you just kind of check the boxes. And the boxes that we checked in this case were, there's a Great Falls native, was a student athlete at the University of Montana, graduated from both of them, which is good, CMR High School, University of Montana, has been in secondary education as a teacher and a coach for 29 years. And you will never be able to tell that by looking at him. He just looks like he fits right in there with the younger crowd. He was a track and field coach at Charlotte for three years, guiding them to three top three finishes at the state championship. He was the head coach at Helena High School for 21 years as a track and field mentor, four third place finishes, four second place finishes, and two state championships. So we have a proven coach. We have a proven educator. We have someone who will be another component as we add to the ambassadorship of what we do through athletics at the University of Providence. And this gentleman will be joining Alan Kress in that program and Alan, who's done a masterful job with the field events, you don't want to hear from me. You want to hear from Coach Arnston. And I will get out of the way. So without further ado, let's introduce him. Coach, come on up. First of all, uh, I, you know, this, uh, this thing happened fast. Uh, it it kind of came out of the blue and uh, something that I never really thought about for a long time. Uh, but man, it, the opportunity came and it rose and, uh, uh, I just couldn't pass it up. I, I had to jump on it. And, you know, the one thing I've learned about in coaching, uh, probably more than anything is you surround yourself with great people. That, that's the first thing you have to work with great people. And as I've dealt with, uh, Mr. Gant, Mr. Hashley, Mr. Schulte, a lot of the other head coaches here, um, it, that's what this is all about. I, I had a quick tour around campus and met some of the, the people that work on campus and, and, and the president. And uh, this is a place I want to work. And um, I, I thank those guys for the opportunity. Uh, the University of Providence, um, from in the short time that I've, I've been following it now, uh, Coach Keller, I go back with him. Uh, back in the Helen High days, and, and so I've followed the basketball program a little bit here the last few years, and, and uh, as, as I met the, the administration here, I love the uh, aggressiveness and the vision that this campus has right now, and, uh, athletically, academically. Um, it, it, it's just exciting for me. It, it was a job opportunity, an opportunity to coach again for me uh, that fit uh, perfectly uh, for my family, uh, our situation right now, and I'm so excited about it. I, I, I really am, and I want to thank everybody for um, for uh, the way that I've been treated the last few uh, weeks as this process has taken place. And, and again, I I got a lot uh, a lot to learn uh, about the university, um, and, and I'm excited about it. You know, uh, I think it's very, very important. Uh, doesn't matter if it's a college program or high school program. I, I, had, I had the fortune of um, basically in the programs that I took over at Charlotte uh, and at Helena High School uh, were rebuilding processes. They were building a program that, that maybe wasn't so great and was struggling a little bit. It needed kids, it needed participants. And, 
And uh, I love that process. Uh, I fed off it. Um, and again, the key was surrounding myself with great people. And, I, and we've done that. Uh, Coach Kress, who, who's going to be the backbone of this thing, no doubt. Uh, he's been here. He understands it. Um, he, he's out in the community. He's, he's, the, the kids know him. He's a great recruiter. Uh, um, I'm going to rely a lot on him as, as we get this thing started. I'm going to surround myself with the people that, that I need to. Um, and uh, the second thing is getting the kids and getting yourself surrounded with kids that you want in your program. And there's not, that, that, that has to happen. And, and hopefully, that's why I've been brought into this. Uh, I, uh, the, the one thing I hope and I do believe that if you talk to kids that I've coached and worked with over the last 30 years, uh, they're going to tell you that they love to play for our, our programs. They love to compete in our programs, whether it was Charlotte, Helen High, All-Star Games during the summer, wh whatever it was. I, I think we surrounded ourselves with the right type of people and, and people that uh, were accountable and they were good people. And that's all, that's, that's all you can ask for. And that's what we're going to recruit here at the University of Providence. I think it's a great opportunity for, for young men and women to come and get a great education in, in a sports community. Uh, this, you know, I, I grew up in Great Falls. Uh, I, I'm a Great Falls guy, no, no, no doubt about it. I've been gone for a while, but it never left me. And, man, I'm happy to get back here. And, and I know how important sports are. And I don't care if it's rodeo or wrestling or hockey or football or basketball or cross country or whatever, whatever it is. Great Falls wants winners, and they support winners. They support people that are successful and do things the right way. And that, that's why I'm happy to be coming back here. I'm awful excited. And again, thanks to all the people that gave me the opportunity. And I can't wait to get started on Monday or tomorrow, whichever. <laughs>